this is a thyroid ultrasound. The first 20 seconds consist of a movie made of multiple images linked together. As it progresses, we'll point out some of the various pathology which is seen. Now we begin the anatomy. Here the trachea, isthmus, and musculature can be seen. A small nodule is seen within the gland. A small nodule is seen in the right lobe of the thyroid gland measuring 0.26 centimeters. This is very small. Here we begin to orient ourselves by finding the trachea first and recognizing that we're looking at the patient's right thyroid lobe. Here we orient ourselves by finding the trachea and the carotid artery. How do we know that this is the carotid artery and not the jugular vein? Well, anatomy tells us that this most likely is the carotid because it doesn't seem to be compressible. This and the next few images are very impressive. They show the trachea very well and the small, thin thyroid isthmus which overlies the trachea. Orientation here clearly shows us which side is the right side of the gland and which side is the left. Without compressibility, I'm not sure if this is the jugular vein or the carotid. Here again we can orient ourselves by finding the left lobe of the thyroid in relationship to the trachea. The trachea is seen on the left side of the screen. In summary, this is basically a normal thyroid ultrasound. There were a few small tiny cysts found, but with practice and orienting yourself by finding the vessels and the trachea, you can rapidly find your way around.